Hi, how y'all doing? It is Monday, the 6th of November, 2023. 6th of November, yeah, I said that right. It's my oldest son's birthday today. Um, woke up in the rising, and it was raining here, and it's been raining all day. The sky's been completely grayed out, no sunshine at all. So, they're up to stuff up there. In the United States, I watched Gina uh, Marie Hill's video, and they were completely Xing out her skies with the contrails, chemtrails, whatever you want to call them, right? But she did a video on it. There was tons of them while they were still doing it, right? So, they're up to something, aren't they? Today is, the Schumann is at 10. So, yeah, my mind... It's a bit slow today, that's why I just messed that up there, right? I've been tired all day, it's the rain. With the fiber, it does that to me. It just drains the energy out of me for some reason, right? I laid down around 2 o'clock, because I was going to fall asleep sitting in the chair. And I kind of sort of napped for almost an hour. And then my eldest son called me, and he wanted me to go out with him for dinner and a few drinks, right, with him and his girlfriend, and I was just, I'm just tired, Justin, I'm too tired, right, I'm not bored, I'm tired, so he's like, okay, I'll walk down, I'm going to start walking, and I'll call you just before I get there, because the restaurant's down by me, right, and uh, see if you changed your mind, so I was like, okay, and so I got my groggy butt up and cleared my head, and around 4 o'clock, I thought, he should have called me by now. So I tried calling him, messaging him. I called him two times. He never answered the phone. And then, just as I was making my dinner, he calls me. Right? And I was like, Justin? He's like, I just noticed you've been calling. He says, i seen your message. Why aren't you answering your phone? And I said, yeah. And he says, I'm, I swear are you. He goes, I'm at Chuck's with his girlfriend, right? waiting on his food to be delivered, having a drink. And I was like, oh, he's like, come on over. I said, why didn't you answer your phone, right? I started making my dinner. I was trying to, you know, I changed my mind. I was going to go out. But then uh, he uh, didn't get a hold of me in time, and I'd already started. So I, he, I told him, I promise you, you asked me to go out again, and I'll go out with you. So I'll keep my word, right? I will. How are you dealing with the energy today? I got a little bit of pain in my sciatic and my piriformis. But other than that, it's pretty good for the Shuma being at 10. It's down like 25 points from yesterday. Right? Weird energy though. It's the planetary alignments and Scorpio. Right? So yeah. I watched this guy can't remember his name now. He's a YouTuber. He was channeling the Pleiadians, okay? And uh, he was asking about what the bad guys got, are gonna, uh, what their plans are and stuff. And he, he's in a bed and he's got a blanket over him and, you know, eye mask and stuff like that. And uh, he said that, well, it's supposed to be them talking, right? said that uh, they're planning on trying to do something with the volcano in the states there, the yellow one, what's it called? I can't remember. They're going to try to erupt it on the 28th of November. So him saying that washes that plan out, right? So all you got to do is bring attention to something, and they can't use it. So strange, right? Well, that's not true, because we knew about the... Uh, the false flappy things, right? Or sideways, I should go, right? But they still try to pull them off. So, hmm. I also seen a thing where um, Zelensky's invited Trump to go over where he is to prove to him he can't make peace in his country with the bear, right? I think that's kind of funny. But we'll see. It's part of the movie, right? It is part of the movie. Maybe this will be a fake assassination on, on the big T. You know? I don't know. It's a 
friggin' weird world. Especially when it's on the internet, right? Everything I see on the internet, oh, I just be like, it's fake, it's AI, it's fake, it's AI. Unless you see it outside in your own flesh, with your own eyeballs, in the fresh air, not on a screen, is it real? That's how I work. Alright, but I like to report on the play, on the movie. So, yeah. I don't have a lot of energy. I just, it's from the two, last two days, the shimmer was high, and we got downgraded, right? So we're in, in, integrating the energies. That's why I feel tired today. It's my body's catching up to my mind. So, yeah. I was out like a light last night, too, when I went to bed. I went to bed early, like 9. Well, see, if the time change it would have been 10, right? Without the time change. So, yeah. Out like a light like that. Slept pretty good all night. Got up around 6.30, I guess, in my mind. So, well, yesterday this would have been 7.30, or 7.30, right? So, it all works out. Other than that, I went for a drive today. I had to take the guy that owns the truck to do some running around in the rising. And he was alright to deal with. He's a too much he's too much pain because of his surgery the other day for his cancer on his liver. So he said he was just gonna go home and sleep. I said that's probably a good idea, have something warm to drink, right? You know what I mean? Your body heals when you sleep. That's what my mother used to tell me. That's why you lay down when you got a cold and you're sick. It's easier. You're not using up the energy to heal, I suppose. Just a guess. Just a guess. So, yeah. Oh, I don't know what to think. I don't know what to think. I really don't know what's going on. I know what I know is true. I do. But, just take it so long. Just one of those days for me. It's a Monday. Let's blame it on the Monday, right? I'm not in a bad mood. I'm not sad. I'm just kind of monotone, level, just doesn't matter. It's a thing, but it ain't a thing. I don't care about, you know, up or down, in or out. I don't. My daughter, the one that's in Ottawa, right, that almost killed herself with alcohol there drinking. And she started AA, right? Well, one of the first uh, uh, posts on Facebook she did after she joined saying, this great here, there's no religion or anything like that. And then today I see her do a post and it's all about religion. She's fucking spouting a fucking prayer, right? And I was like, oh man, she, they got her, right? They fucking got her. I just hope my granddaughter is safe. That's all. But then I thought, well, when I got um, better and I stopped taking those stupid pills doctors gave me, um, I thought about religion again, too. I started praying and stuff like that. And then I did meditation on to meet God, and it turned out not to, what, to be what I thought it was. So the more spiritual I got, the more I got turned away from that. And then when Rod Hayes showed me the receipts on YouTube, right? And he says the same thing as I said about we never had a Bible here in Canada before the missionaries came. So, and they were doing quite fine. Do you know what I mean? And so when he showed the receipts, I was like, yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. So to me, that's a confirmation. So, she's just going to probably go through the same thing I went through. It takes a while to heal your brain after you've been polluting it for years with alcohol and drugs now, doesn't it? Only a year, if you work at it. That's how it worked for me anyway. But I'm a fast learner. So, yeah. I was tell telling my son yesterday, too, about confirmations, right? I said, when this star, this war started and everything after 2020, right? Um, I was thinking I was losing my mind and I asked my guardian angel to find me somebody I could watch that knew the same stuff I did to prove to me that I wasn't wrong and I wasn't losing my mind. 
right? I was very down and out and depressed and, you know, quite upset about it after just spending, you know, the last, oh, what, five, seven years healing my brain, right? So, um, rewiring it and stuff, right? After the alcohol, uh, the drug, the pills, right? And, um, boom, this woman shows up on YouTube, a tarot card reader, and I never watched them before, right? I had, I got a friend read my tarot cards, me and my second husband, once back when we were living in B.C., so, and it was like, what she said was like pretty much all the money for me and him, right? And, uh, so I seen this woman on the YouTube, her name was Janine, and I was like, I looked at her picture and picture, and I was like, all right, I'll try it. I turned it on, and don't you know, the questions she was asking her cards and the answers she, she was getting were just like mine. And I was so grateful. And I was like, thank you, thank you, thank you. Right? It was a confirmation. And then about a couple months back, I thought, I should call my, give my house, my dwelling a name. And I was like, what name? And I closed my eyes and I thought about it. And I said, Isabella. Right? It's a nice name for a house. So I was okay. Isabella, my dwelling. And uh, about a day later, I turned on YouTube and this picture came up, a video came up, Isabella by Tarot. And I thought, isn't that strange, right? So I clicked on it, and she was another person that knows the same stuff I do. These are confirmations, aren't they? They are. And then today, I seen this tarot card reader, and I thought, okay, we'll see what she's saying, right? I'm not checking on love or any of that because when that happens it will happen if it doesn't it doesn't I'm good either way right I am I have to tough it out that's what you have to do so I clicked her on and I started watching her and don't you know she mentions Benedict Arnold and I was like what that's my ancestor Okay, and then she holds up three cards, and guess what the name of one of the cards is? Teresa. And I was like, okay. And it was like, your ancestors are trying to get in touch with you. They're trying to give you signs, right? And you're just not catching them. And I thought, well, that's got to be a sign, right? Benedict Arnold and Teresa, right? So, yeah. Another confirmation. I'm, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. i got to pay more attention to the signs. I do. So, yeah. I hope you're all doing okay where you're at. Right? Just come at everything with love. Yeah. All right. That's enough. I love you all as consciousness. Enjoy this night or day. Okay? Okay. Bye.